Hey, I've got some of the creepiest stuff going on by uh, Donald Trump here to play for you. And I'm, I'm kind of distraught by the entire thing because it's so sick. Donald Trump has made a number of really strange comments uh, about his 33 year old daughter, Ivanka Trump, over the last several years. And he seems to have no plan of changing that now that he's running for president. The Rolling Stone article that came out last week referencing an interview with Donald Trump read Trump saying about his daughter. Yeah, she's really something. And what a beauty that one. If I weren't happily married and, you know, her father dot 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 sort of saying Trump would be interested in dating and having sex with his own daughter if it weren't for the fact that she's his daughter and ring of fire started looking into whether this is an isolated, completely bizarre comment from Donald Trump or whether there's a long track record of it. And as it turns out, Lewis, there's a long track record of it. Here's Donald Trump appearing with his daughter on The View a few years ago. Take a listen to this. So, uh, uh, Donald, mm. all right, I, I'm, I'm afraid to ask this question, but what would you do, Playboy put Ivanka on the cover of the magazine if she had not... This is going to be an interesting answer. Uh -huh. <laughs> she, he doesn't even want you to have a drink. I know him, so... It would be really disappointing. Not really. <laughs> but it would depend on what was inside the magazine. If, oh, no, if oh, she posed, it would be fine. But if they put her picture yeah, on... Yeah, but it depends on what goes inside the magazine. Well, see, that's her gripe. Right. That's right. this girl's gripe. Right. Mm -hmm. People there assume nothing. there'll be nude, nude photos. Right, you do assume Misleading. that with Playboy. Okay, she, but if there weren't, Playboy... you wouldn't have an issue with it then. If they were using her to... I don't think Ivanka would do that inside the magazine, although she does have a very nice figure. I've said that if Ivanka weren't my daughter, perhaps I'd be dating her. You know? <laughs> Stop it! Oh, it's so weird! Stop it! <laughs> you know what? You... Ugh, I mean, it's just... It, this is like... This is setting on uh, setting off creepy alarms left and right, Lewis. And then back in 2003, when he was on the Howard Stern show again, Donald Trump uh, seemingly drooling over his own daughter's great body that he's obsessed with. Take a listen to this. You she's know, right. who's, you know, who's one of the great beauties of the world, according to everybody. And I helped create her Who? Ivanka, my <laughs> daughter, is. Ivanka. Yeah, she's six feet tall. She's got the best body. Yeah, she's hot. She made a lot of money as a model, a tremendous amount. And then <laughs> she went cold turkey and gave it all up because she had to go to college because I wanted her to go to college. She goes to the best college. Wharton. She goes to Wharton. She's got straight A's. Yeah, her straight A's. She just has Lewis this. It's the best body. His daughter has the best body. This is just straight up creep central. There is a huge difference, Lewis. Like if let's say, Lewis, you accidentally had a kid and you love the kid, right? Things work out well the way we would like. You love the kid. It's a daughter. It would be perfectly reasonable to say my daughter is very beautiful. I have a beautiful daughter rather than if I were a single man, I'd be pursuing my daughter because of her great body and her height. It's just she's stunning. And I would consider being with her sexually if I were single and she wasn't my daughter. There's a huge difference between A and B there. Yeah, uh, there's a reason why nobody says those things. And uh, <laughs> to say them as a presidential candidate is, well, I, I think a really, really bad decision. That being said, do I think it's going to impact his campaign? No. L listen, Lewis, if Donald Trump's campaign with uh, the the c uh, Republican base is not going to be impacted by the fact that he cheated on one wife with another wife, uh, uh, you know, the, the entire thing by the fact that he is uh, c completely living the opposite of the values that he claims to espouse, if if they're not going to drop him for that, I quite frankly don't think that him finding his daughter incredibly attractive is going to turn off that many of those voters if they've already gotten past the stuff he's already said and done. Not at all. I mean, yeah, uh, for us, this is uh, something we can look at and say, whoa, Donald Trump is even more nuts than we thought. <laughs> but, but if you've already decided that you're backing this candidate, I don't really think there's anything he can say that's going to deter you. So let, let me see if I understand. Uh, you're backing the guy who thinks his own daughter is super hot and would date her, right? Yeah, yeah, that's the guy I'm backing. But it's really all over how he would deal with China. Uh, China or Mexico? I <laughs> yeah, well, <laughs> both, I guess. We, he certainly commented about both. So there it is. Donald Trump, very, very attracted to his own daughter. And oh, what he would do to her, Lewis, if she simply were not his daughter. Let's take a break. After the break, I will speak to Matthew Gollumbeck, 
a fellow University of Massachusetts graduate who now works for the great Jet Propulsion Laboratory of NASA. He will talk to us. No fantasy land stuff, Lewis. Where do we need to land on Mars? Not if, but when we go, as Matthew Gollumbeck says. Stay with us. It's Monday. What a program we have today.